Well, as you're aware, in my last review, I not only burned myself, but gave the product a very bad rating. And in fact, I'm unable to eat the product because it's just bleh, nasty. And I said I do not recommend it. I always believed in following up my review by actually contacting the company and made the product and advising them on some changes they can make to improve it. Now you guys can see my email, so if you want to recommend a product for me to try, within reason, I can file saying if I'm going to try it or not. Remember, I'm eating it. But go ahead, make a re recommendation if it's available where I'm at, then I'll do it. Everything else, I've, of course, you know, censored out because you don't need to see all that. And now here's the message I sent to him. It says at the top here, although we love to hear your comments and encourage you to give us feedback about our products, please understand that we cannot accept suggestions for new products, advertising, promotions, etc. from any outside our company. This policy is necessary to prevent misunderstandings as the origins of ideas. Fine. Good. Here's my feedback. Message. Dear Swanson, first of all, the most important thing when attempting to follow your instructions in regard to removing the brownie from the product, I received, let's try it, a first degree burn. The product was undercooked, resulting in a gooey mess which required assistance for extraction. This, of course, stuck to my finger, resulted in said burn and use of a burn kit. I advise proper caution labels to be placed on tray and by extraction instructions. Furthermore, the cooking instructions are incorrect. I have proven that my microwave is unbiased from product to product. Brownie cooked properly in prior instructions for boneless pork and not in this, meaning that the cook time for this product is incorrect. I revise first round for cooking for beef pot roast to be changed to five minutes first round to allow proper cooking of the brownie and then removal. Second round of cooking should remain the same. Product was undercooked and not satisfactory. This message applies to Hungry Man Labels Beef Pot Roast. I have not tried any other Swanson Beef Pot Roast. Please reply in due course. Thank you. Let's actually add this. Or, you can enter and include in the digitally wrapped in brownie. Which is in our book and easily be set aside. Other items and unless with great success, no excuse for you not to do the same. I think that covers it. We shall see if I actually get a good response from them or I get blown off one to two. I would not be surprised. Send a message. The message is too long limited 1000 characters. Oh really? Let's try that. Okay Swanson you're going to piss me off. There's no way I can get all this across in that short Bam. But we shall chop this stuff up. And sending, finally. I lost great content, but message sent, we appreciate your feedback. Just on some page. Now we will wait for a reply from them. Please wait, loading the page. Cool, we're done. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Quick proof that the mail was actually sent and received. Yippity do da day. 
I'll go on.